game thus far. Gains the zone on the left wing. Slides it diagonally to Thompson. The Rangers gain possession along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Gustafson's going to play it against the half wall. And he takes a shot. Nothing. Sometimes players get into those scoring areas and they try and get a little too cute and that's a result right there not hitting the net. And they got caught up in traffic and hits a stick. Puck leaves the offensive end. They'll be forced to do it again. Angles it over to Clutterbuck. The Islanders have it now. Gains the zone. Clutterbuck's got it in the corner. Quick feed to Thompson. And that goes off course off a body. And he takes the pass. Tries to feed it over to Clutterbuck. And the puck skips away after a nice defensive deflection. And he takes the feed. Passes up front. And he shuts down a 
great scoring chance there. Poked away at center by Dobson. Puck picked up by Riley. Pass it up ahead. And now he moves it quickly to Martin. Feeds the puck over to McLean. Make a change, make a change. Denied by the goaltender. Shesterkin's going to slow it down here and hang on for the whistle. Well, a good decision right there to dictate the tempo of the game, especially when he hasn't been busy. He's engaging right now. Looks like lineups are set. They're ready to get things back underway. Horvath's won the draw here in the offensive zone. The Rangers gain possession. Puck grab by Lindgren. The Rangers take it across the blue line. Slides the puck over. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Shot! That's not going to fool him. Moves it to Nelson. Slick feed. Lindgren's taking it from his own end. Moves it quickly over to Kreider. Oh, a spectacular save right there. Wow! Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Huge steal in his own end. The Rangers move the puck in the defensive zone. Change lines, come on! Excellent stick work on the play. The Islanders have it behind the cage. Moves it up. Picked up along the boards by Lee. Here he is, wrestled on them. Denies him in front. A timely save is everything to your team in this goal. Oh, he saved it. Oh, my goodness, what a stall. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. Here's a pass. And the defense come away with it here. And they skate it out of the danger zone. And they'll dump it in. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. The Rangers going to work on offense. Puck scooped up by Clutterbuck. Quick shot! Scores! And look at the glare from the goaltender after that went off someone in front. the midway mark in this period. It's all tied up. And after the draw at center, they've got a hold of the puck. Sends it into the offensive zone. Romanov stick handling in his own zone. Now he takes it over the line. There's a shot. Kicked away. Nice pad save by the goaltender. The Islanders will play it against the boards. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by the Frenier. Puck is scooped up here inside the offensive zone by McLean. The Rangers have it behind the net. There's the whistle who will get a face-off after all that chaos. Well, this is a much-needed reset for his team after some sustained ozone pressure by the opponent. Here in the later stages of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Trocek's won the draw here in the defensive zone. And he takes the dish. Lafreniere's got the puck. Gets a pat on it. What a stop by Sorokin. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Well, that's not a difficult one for the official. He was in full stride when he hit his opponent. That's charging. The Rangers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Well, first power play of the game, James. You want to start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. 
can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. And they send it down the ice. Rocks him along the wall. Let's move to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Denies him again. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there, James. He was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Dumps the puck in. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Quick pass across to Panarin. The Rangers will play it from the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Panarin. Takes the feet at the back end. Glove save. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Pachot is ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Fires it into the offensive zone. And that's stolen by Holmstrom. Turn that chance aside. As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Centering feed. And that doesn't go as it's off the stick. Lafreniere is the victim of a slash, and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. Quick pass to Capo. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Well, it's not good timing to take this penalty, James, late in the frame and a close game at that, but they just got to get to the intermission and then they can reset. The Rangers send their man advantage unit out once more. Though they haven't scored on the power play yet, man, it is a tough thing to do, and this is an earned opportunity. They practice, they know what they're doing, it'll come. Poked away in the offensive end. push attack there's way too much runway left in this game James you're in the first period you got to find a way to continue to compete continue to maintain the momentum and put your opponent on their heels Sisnikas plays it against the boards Kakos lugging the puck and he uses his reach to disrupt the play There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? The Islanders are trailing in the game by one, James, and that's tough. It can be deflating when you hold the majority of the possession. They're going to need to convert that possession if they want to get back in this game. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his crease, take away all the ice, and make himself as big as possible. There's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Well, this is a really great save, Gene. Here he is, all alone. He scores! Oh, wow, what a finish! Well, I love that he used his speed and didn't slow down, James. And it's all about patience and composure, outgaining the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. He's going to get rewarded for his efforts here, James, but it all starts from his anticipation and his breakaway speed to close away from the pack. And then he knows exactly what he's going to do, or at least he fools us and the goaltender because he puts it in the back of the net. The Rangers 
make their way back to center now, boasting a two-goal lead here in the second. Uh, and you can certainly see that they're playing more relaxed, much easier when you got a two-goal lead here, James. But I've liked everything about their game tonight. They've been creative, they've played free, but they've also been defensively responsible. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. The Rangers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Truba's got it in the defensive end. Works it across to Pajo. Gaining momentum up along the side. Centering pass in front. Scores! What a finish on the play! Precision passing is what leads to this one-timer opportunity. And it wasn't just an opportunity, James. It was a direct finish as he just slaps it and hammers it home. The Islanders needed that, Cheryl, and they seem to have some life now. Well, they've shortened the deficit, and there's nothing better to get you back in the game than one goal to put themselves on their toes. But again, they're going to have to have an attack mentality if they want to get an equalizer. Taken along the wall by Romanov. From along the boards, moves the puck ahead. Puts it in deep. Quick feed to Trocek. Receives the pass. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Oh, big time save by Sorokin! The key to being a great goaltender is not giving up second shot opportunities, and it's playing the rebounds to the corner. He does an excellent job here. Moves inside! dialed in here tonight gets the full use of his stick on the poke check all oh, the officials were all over that trip here comes the Saints tough spot to be in you need momentum and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one I like the 1 3 1 set on the power play unit they used earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored, but there's so many variations off of it. I love the bumper position that can act as a decoy, allow the puck to get through to create those seams and open up those shot attack lanes. Puck clears the zone. The Rangers will play it in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. The Islanders take over on possession, and they clear that puck. Truba's moving the puck through his own zone. Across the line and on the attack. Big hit and that frees up possession. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Slides it diagonally to Lafreniere. Oh, what a hit on the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. Projects looking to win this draw on this man advantage here. The Rangers take possession here inside the offensive zone. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Sezikis gets set for the face-off here as they will continue to play shorthanded. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Oh, what a stop! Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get the puck out of the zone, and that's a break for the squad. Oh, uh, yeah, this PK unit, they're out there for a reason, James. You have to be able to clear the puck, and it's easier said than done, but they make no mistake this time. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound. Here. And the game's got it in the own end. Kreider's got it against the boards. Moves it to Panarin. Sends the pass over. And the puck dies with the trapper save. Still lots of time left in the period. The Rangers have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. 
Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Moves the puck. Here they come on the attack. Nelson's got it in the offensive zone. The Islanders have it against the wall. What a steal in his own end. Into the attacking area from the left side. And they'll just dump it in and go for a line change. The Islanders look to start the transition game. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. That's sent in deep. Angles it over to Goodrow. Moves the puck across to Lindgren. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Into the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Thompson. Blocked in front. Takes the puck at the point. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Here's a howitzer at the net. Scores! They tied it up, and we are back to even. Well, working hard, sticking to the game plan with good habits, and they're back to evens. When we have a look at it, James, it looks like it's redirected, and that's just beautiful timing and get the hands away from the body, be able to get it to go the opposite direction of the goaltender. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. The Rangers take possession in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Cooley. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Quick pass to VC. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Taken by Lee. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Drives it to the crease. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. He really owns the crease when he drops into that butterfly positioning. And for the shooter, I think it's intimidating. He makes himself as big as possible. And everyone knows he's athletic to boot. Sent into the offensive zone. The Rangers have it now. Looks to pass it to Brodzinski. Quick feed to Truba. Here's a shot. Oh, and he steps up with the glove to stop that one. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. winger as the two setters tie up. Scooped up along the wall by Romanov. Retreats with the puck inside the defensive zone. Takes a shot, and he comes up with a stop there. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. More than half the period has expired. We got a tie game. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Fires it into the offensive zone. Gustafson's taking it from his own end. Slides the pass over to Sabinashad. Great poke by Kako. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. Gains the zone through center. The Rangers have it now. From the left side, takes it at center. Oh, what a chance, and that goes off target. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. On the attack, they come down the right wing. The Rangers gain control of the puck. Great read with the stick. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Shot! Shuts him down! Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. 
Clutterbuck's moving it ahead. Wax it into the offensive zone. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Can't maintain possession. And here's the pass to Trocek. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Moves it to Martin. Poked away yet centered by Panarin. Gets the puck in deep. The Islanders gain control of the puck. Along the half wall with the puck. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Takes that pass back at the point. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Takes the feed. Moves it quickly over to Fox. The Rangers move the puck in the defensive zone. Takes the pass. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a chance. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Dumps it into the O-zone. The Rangers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Slides it over to Lindgren. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Under a minute to go here inside the second period. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. The Rangers play it along the boards. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Here's a feed in front. A blast! Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. minutes to play in the books. Both teams will get one last chance to catch their breath, and then it's on to period number three next. three just moments away as the official signals both teams into position. Well, time to find out who wants this one more as we are underway in the third. Moves it to Lindgren. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Kreider. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Just a little... Oh, denied on the play! Wow! Oh, the true competitor save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Quick pass to Horvath. Misses a golden opportunity there. Yes, a scores! Well, who needs the man advantage or the extra attacker as they quickly strike? Well, they had possession. They recognized the lane. And to be truthful, the defensive structure, well, they just collapsed and played soft. you got to be able to attack, and then result, a goal. I love that he fights to get tight to the net here, and it's all about accuracy and a quick release. It's not about how hard it is, and he doesn't miss. The Islanders have to be feeling good about themselves after taking the lead with that goal here in the third. Yeah, and it's not much of a cushion the way this game has gone back and forth, James, but it's something. You're in the lead, so now you want to continue with that tempo. Find a way to push your opponent back. Continue to punch and press. Dobson's got the puck in his own zone. Up along the wing. Textbook poke check by Kako. Backtracks with the puck, but maintains possession. Quick feed to Lee. The Rangers ready to go on the attack. Oh, and what a save as he gets that one, too. This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot, and makes the save. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Islanders are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. The Rangers take control of the faceoff. Gives them a jolt with that hit. Moves it to Trocek. The Islanders have the puck now. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. The Rangers have it from their own end. 
tries to feed it over to Panarin. Takes a shot. Oh, what a bad save by Sorokin. Great reach by Panarin. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Reads the play and forces the turnover. Moves the puck along the half wall. Moves it quickly over to Lafreniere. Let's it go for the back end. And that goes off a player. Here's a short pass to Engvall. Handles the pass. Feces crossed the line and gained the zone. And that shot dies in traffic. Big time save! Oh my goodness! He scores! Right on point! Wow! Goal chains. I mean, you're heavy on the floor check, pounding the pucks, you're not allowing your opponent to get anywhere. They're back on their heroes. You continue to wear them down. They cannot get a line change, and you make sure that you convert on the opportunity. That's just a great goal. The Rangers get the equalizer, and look at this with the time of this game. Huge, Cheryl. Huge goal with respect to timing as well, James. Not only is it the equalizer, it tells me one thing. They made the adjustments that they talked about in the intermission. A great start to the third. Takes it and looks ahead. Nelson's been great tonight, James. He's got a goal in the game, but now the score is tied. He'll be looking to break it for his team. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Romanov. Takes the feed. Broken up by Truba. Uses the force on that hit. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. VC's tried a great move there. We all know what great hands he is in tight, trying to create some space, but it bobbles off his stick, and he lost possession. Inside the offensive zone. The Islanders get a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Nelson. Pass back to the point. Big save in front. That's a great save as he drops into the butterfly. You want to make sure that you take away the top of the net, but you know you got the lower net covered, and the agility to be able to move across the crease is an example right there. McLean stick handling in his own zone. And now he moves it to Romanov. Sends a pass over. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. They have to have talent, they have to have mobility, they have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Still lots of time left here in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Goodros won the draw here in their own zone. The Rangers take it along the wall. Now he slides it up to Goodrow. Just a great defensive read there. And now it's grabbed by Goodrow. So Sirkin's been so impressive, in particular in that last sequence, James. And he is out of gas. It didn't prevent him from making that save. But now he's going to get some much-needed rest as that puck heads out of his zone. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. There's the whistle icing the call. Big face off looming. Past the halfway mark of this period, it's all tied up. The Islanders win the draw. Huge win by the center to give his team an opportunity to get out of the zone after a critical icing. A chance in front! They score! And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift. You can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. Well, a costly defensive zone turnover leaves everyone out of position, including the goaltender, and he does a great job of just putting it inside the post for the goal. The Rangers have found the go-ahead goal here in the back half of the third period. This is exactly where they want to be, James. Late in the third period, you have the lead. Now you have the momentum. You certainly want to attack, but you want to make sure that you're in good defensive posture when the puck transitions. Here's an attack with a stick, and the referees don't like it. And the official...
officials will pass the Sims here. Important task for the PKers ahead of them, up by one, and a real opportunity protected. And their first chance to use the man advantage. Power plays are a funny thing, especially when you're down by one, James. You have to act as if you are the hunter, and you have to possess that puck and attack. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. That's off a stick. And they manage to clear it. Feeds the puck across to Lee. Here's a chance. Oh, tremendous save on the play. What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James, and the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They are really applying the squeeze. And they'll end all that pressure as they clear the zone. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're shorthanded. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. Let's get our third member of the broadcast team back in here, our own Carlin Bade. What you got going on? Fox has jumped in on the offense, and he's used his zone ability to do so, just like we talked about, guys. He's got the edge in this matchup. Takes it off, but he's still got the puck. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. More than half the frame has been played here. One goal game here. 5-4 is where we sit. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Quick pass across to Holmstrom. And sends it just out of reach. The Rangers gain control of the puck against the wall. Great cross ice pass. Puts it on net. Grabbed along the board by Nelson. Savannah Jads really impressed me with that last play, James. I mean, to have the wherewithal to hold on to that puck. I mean, that's tenacity on your way down, falling to the ice and still get the shot off. That's leadership at its best. Shesterk has got the puck and he's going to hang on. Horvath's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Rangers win the defensive zone faceoff. Quick feed to Dobson. Handles it along the blue line. Trapper save, didn't get all of it, but still enough. Great poke check on the reach. Quick feed down low. The Rangers fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. And that's blocked away. Barzell's lugging the puck. Horvath's picking up momentum through center. With possession along the wall. Just slide to the net. The Rangers gain possession. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Oh, and he whiffs. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Islanders come up with the defensive zone draw. Romanov's got it along the boards. Moves it to Palmieri. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Looks to set up at the point now. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Let's one go. And another stop. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Moves it quickly over to Lafreniere. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, everyone has a role. This PK unit knows that they not only have to kill this penalty off and keep the game within reach, but maybe they can be opportunistic and pounce on a loose puck for an opportunity. The Rangers once again send out their power play unit, and what a golden opportunity here. Well, they've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. The man is if ineffective. Pays it up from the point. Great save with the stick. They are really dialed in here tonight. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. 
Kreider's got it in the defensive end. Works it across to Fox. They go on the attack through center. Centering pass. Oh, what a chance. And he fanned on the puck. No room for that one to get through. Puck sent over to Pellet. On the attack along the boards. Here's a short pass to Fox. Fires it. Turned aside with a glove by Shusterkin. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Brzezinski's won a big draw on their own end. The Rangers pick up steam and are on the attack. Quick pass to Brzezinski. Shot! Here's a shot! And he stags that one with the glove. Side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. And they win the draw here in their own end. The Islanders slide it through center. Dumps it in. The Rangers scoop it up along the boards. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. The Rangers go over on the power play, and with it, a blown opportunity to see. Scores! Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Islanders take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. The Rangers will play it in their own end. And he slides it quickly to Capo. Right away! Can't get that one to go! That's extremely frustrating when you do the work to get in on a breakaway and then you get nothing in return. A missed opportunity. Steps inside. Gotta find a way to get back into this one as they trail the extra attackers on the ice. The Rangers fire some the empty net. They score! Yeah, and this one will all but seal the deal. Change a real insurance marker and a game well fought and a win well earned. On the dying moments of the game, they get the empty netter, James, and that's just a result of having urgency, making sure they protect the middle of the ice, and hey, they get it down the ice and get the empty netter to boot. The Rangers have had no short of the scoring opportunities tonight, and they have capitalized and look at the scores as a result. Pachos won the draw at center. Quick feed to Sabinashad. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Huge steal on his own end. And the fans on their feet recognizing a solid victory here in front of them. And off the draw, they win possession. Fox is moving the puck through his own zone. to the early one up the lead. There was the counter punch that we expected tonight to even the series show. Uh, I think we're getting a little bit of a snapshot as to what this series is going to look like, James. And, you know, you get down one and you know that you've got to claw your way back in. You've got to split because if you go down two, that's way too much momentum in one way for your opponent. Hope everyone had as much fun as we did here tonight for all of us at EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski saying peace.